law enforcement has to step it up here and make a point of pointing out these brothers or anybody else who wants to try and uh, thumb their nose at the law. Calgary police arrested the Poloski brothers on Saturday. Church leaders known for organizing gatherings against public health measures. They've been doing this for months and getting away with it, raising questions around the enforcement authority of Alberta Health Services. AHS is trying to dole out some sort of punishment, but they realize that there's no enforcement behind them to make it stick. It, it was probably kind of a little bit of hand in hand that they stepped up their position when they realized that CPS or other uh, parts of the, the province were going to back them when they were to, you know, lower the hammer. So I, I don't know that it's entirely their fault. I think that politically in Alberta, there's never been a lot of support for trying to curb uh, freedoms of gathering and things like that. Arthur and David Pelosky have been charged with organizing an illegal in-person gathering, including encouraging others to join in. CPS say they served the Pelosky's the new court order prior to Saturday's church service, but they chose to ignore it. Alberta has increased fines for those caught violating health measures, doubling it from the previous price, and new enforcement protocols are in effect across the province. Calgary Police, Edmonton Police, the RCMP, if they're going to actively go out and make a point of saying, we will not permit this, we won't look the other way, we're going to give blindingly punitive fines that really make you think uh, of defying the, the position now of the government to, in supporting a lockdown, then it can be effective. And there is the chance to save some of the summer. The problem is that the people that want to violate the orders um, are going to ruin it for those that are law abiding. So it's almost like the, their bad behavior gets rewarded and those that are behaving get punished. Police ask anyone organizing or participating in outdoor events to make sure they are familiar with the new health guidelines in the province. In Calgary, Hina Said, City News.